Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing, I'm going to show you all of my clear slimes. So, let's just start. Okay. Oh dear, we're just going to stop here. Okay. Now, some of these don't clear. And some of them do, so you're just going to have to cut me a little slack. I don't really know which one's clear and which ones don't, so, yeah. Okay, so, that's on. Okay, now some of these aren't clear and some of them are clear. It's just how it's going to happen. So, hold on, let me just take this off real quick. Okay, so we're gonna start with this here. This is my Happy Valentine's Day slime. And it was clear. It does have Play-Doh in it. And so this is my slime. So, here's this one. And I did do a makeover of it um, in one of my last videos, I think. I'm not really sure. So, yep, here's the one. Okay. And then we have my blue jelly cube. Uh, honestly, this was a clear slime and it has Play-Doh in it and it gets really hard. <laughs> I don't know why, but it's like really hard, so yeah, I'm not gonna, I'll just show you guys like how hard it is, like it just rips, and it was like a super overactivated slime, and the Play-Doh melts the slime, so yeah, okay, so now we're gonna go ahead and move on, actually we're gonna say the big one for last, so this is summer sunshine slime Blech. and this one is another jelly cube slime it is a little bit sticky but it's okay we'll just i'll just do a quick case more so here it is The ones with the jelly cubes, you can't really poke, but I'll show you a jelly cube. It, it doesn't really make any noises. So here it is. So yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna put that in there. And then we'll move on to the next one. It's kind of messy over there. Okay, now this one's all foggy. Sorry about that, because I've been playing with it. I love clear spots. So, but it's clear at the bottom and it's foggy at the top, so. I'll show you guys. Look at how beautiful. Okay. I can do a part two if you want to see them all clear up. So, yeah. So, just comment down below and hit that like button. So, yeah. Let me just do a finishing swirl. Ta da! Okay. This one's really nice. This one's probably the best one. And I am going to be showing my store-bought slime, but that one's going to go last. Okay, this one's really pretty. This one's called Unicorn's Bit. Oh, guys, if you're wondering, I don't have a name for this one. I think it's like Pink Cotton Candy or something, but I was thinking of that to name it, but I don't really know. So this is Unicorn's Bit. This one's really nice. See, see that? It has like those little nail beads thingies in it and this one's really stretchy it doesn't clear up all the way I don't know why but it's 
really thick and nice, so yeah. Okay, I'll just do a finishing swirl. Ta-da! Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, okay. Oh, into the next one. And the next one is this is my pearl pink slime. Here it is. And by the way, guys, if you're wondering what it was colored with, it's actually colored with watercolor. So my tip is add it after you have made the slime. Add the watercolor because when you get the watercolor wet and you add it in when you're making the slime, it'll make it kind of jiggly, and you don't if you don't want to jiggle slime, you don't really want to do that. So it looks like a pigment, pigmented, pearly look. So, and this one's a little overactivated. There's not much I can do with it. So I can just give it all, like the best swirl that I can with it. So yeah. There's that one. And then two more. Okay, this one I think it might be clear. I don't really know. It looks a little foggy to me, but I'll just take it out and show you guys. So here it is. This is this is my ocean slime. So it's just a clear slime with blue glitter. So yeah, just like one of my favorites. It's so pretty. And by the way, guys, if you didn't know, my favorite color is blue. Just saying. So, yeah. Okay. I'll do a finishing swirl. Make it look nice for you. Ta-da! This is the crazy art. Crazy. It's called Cray with Crazy with a Z slimes. It's made by Crazy Art and it's they have the neon blue pre-made slime. So yeah. Okay guys, when I first got it, it was kind of overactivated. But after I let it sit for a while, then it got like so nice. But it does leave weird oils on your hands, so I don't really know, but yeah, I'll just, I'll just show you guys. So, oh, it's so pretty, and it's really thick and nice, and a lot of people say that the Crazy Art glue is really thin, and the Elmer's glue is really thick, so I'm like... And they use Elmer's glue in this? But I don't really know, so. Which I'm sure you can find out if we read the contents of it, but. I don't know. So, yeah. Out of all of them, this one. And this one are probably my favorite. They're the prettiest. And I really like this one, but. It's just. Still kind of overactivated, and it doesn't make the best bubbles or anything like that, but it's nice. So, yeah. There it is. And I don't think I can really swirl with it, but I can try. It's for you guys and girls. I don't know. Okay, there we go. Okay, guys. That's all for today. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that post notification bell for every time I post a video. And I think that's it. So, bye!